Today, we're diving into the turbulent waters of the Max original comedy series, Our Flag Means Death. Now, if you're a fan like us, you probably felt the shockwave of disappointment when news broke about the abrupt cancellation. But fear not, because in this video, we're going to make a case for why Our Flag Means Death truly deserves a third season. Let's set sail, shall we? You know the world of pirate shows has been somewhat quiet since the days of Captain Jack Sparrow. Enter Our Flag Means Death, a series that dared to be different. Instead of the usual swashbuckling and pillaging, it crafted a touching love story with a comedic twist. Stade Bonnet's journey from a wealthy landowner to a pirate added a fresh perspective to the genre. Steedy, played brilliantly by Rise Darby, took us on a journey of self-discovery. The series explored the complexities of pirate life, the struggles of acceptance, and the growth of its characters. The heartwarming yet irreverent comedy perfectly complemented the eclectic cast. Let's talk about the stand-up performances. Rise Darby as Stade and Taika Waititi as Blackbeard were a dynamic duo. Their characters, Ed and Steed, were outsiders in their own right, struggling to find acceptance. The series beautifully portrayed Blackbeard's struggle to overcome his toxic traits, adding depth to the notorious pirate figure. But it's not just about Ed and Stead A. The supporting cast, including Frenchie, Black Pete, Oluwande, and Jim, added layers to the story. The ensemble dynamic brought a sense of community and showcased the power of unity among a pirate crew. Now, let's talk about the juicy bits. The second season finale, Merman, left us hanging with a major cliffhanger. Izzy Han's emotional farewell set the stage for Ed and stayed seeking revenge, promising an exciting third season. The alliance with Zheng Yui Sao adds another layer to the story, with the potential for her backstory to be explored further. The possibilities are endless, and it's heartbreaking to think that we might not get to see them unfold. But wait, there's more to the story. Our flag means death suffered from an unusual release strategy. Dropping the entire second season in October limited its time in the spotlight. A primetime Sunday night slot could have allowed the series to grow its audience steadily. It's a missed opportunity for a show that deserved more recognition. Sadly, it's not the only one. Other Max shows like Winning Time, Westworld, and Raised by Wolves, faced premature cancellations, leaving us scratching our heads. Now, let's address the elephant in the room. Our flag means death tackled progressive themes and featured prominent Lubito characters. The series successfully modernized outdated genre stereotypes and opened itself up to a broader audience. Cancelling a show with such potential feels like a step backward. In a time where representation matters, our flag means death stood out, and its cancellation is concerning for the future of diverse storytelling on TV. In conclusion, Our Flag Means Death was a gem that deserved better. Its unique approach to the pirate genre, outstanding performances, and the setup for a thrilling third season make it a tragedy that it won't continue. If you, like us, believe in the importance of diverse and innovative storytelling, share this video, spread the word, and let's make some noise to bring back our flag means death for a third season. Until then, may your sails be full and your seas be exciting. Fair winds and following seas, everyone.